In just a couple of weeks, we have Eric Church here in concert at the T-Mobile Center. Bartle Hall at the Convention Center is hosting thousands of people for the Triple Crown Volleyball Tournament. And businesses and hotels in the area are loving the boost in sales. The Marriott downtown is already sold out for that weekend. When you think about how robust and busy Kansas City is getting ready to be, um, just the volleyball alone has a pretty big impact. Kathy Nelson is the CEO of Kansas City Sports Commission and Visit KC. She says Triple Crown usually brings in about 20,000 people. So the hotels will be bustling. Total economic impact for the six-day volleyball tournament, more than $12 million. They're staying in the, our hotels. They're going out to eat. They're maybe um, you know, being transported via taxi or Uber. They might fly in, they might drive in and buy gas. Working for you, Hotels.com shows a dramatic spike in prices come February 18th and fewer rooms available. The Sheridan Crown Center only has two left, both the presidential suites. Hotel Kansas City has six rooms available at $439 per night. The weekend prior, a room is only $219. The Crossroads Hotel's rate for February 18th is $359 when rooms there normally go for 222. Nelson says bustling hotels and higher rates are positive signs, especially coming out of a pandemic. I just think it's great that they'll be able to put some more money in their pockets and, and you know, keep some employees on board. There's no doubt these sidewalks will be filled with people that weekend. Nelson says don't forget to be kind so our guests come back. Next up for big sporting events in Kansas City, the Big 12 tournament, March 9th. Reagan Porter, Fox 4, working for you.